Tracy Ikopitz and I'm back with more news for you. Ugandan Christian leaders took Easter Sunday as an opportunity to speak out against greed and corruption, citing the Karamoja Iron Sheets incident as an example. Many high-ranking officials are being investigated over their involvement in the scandal. Archbishop Paul Semogere described greed and corruption as a cancer that has infested the nation. The Buganda Katikiro criticized those involved, saying that it's stifling the country's development. This involved more people than any other corruption scandal and has caused untold embarrassment to the country. Tabo Biestad, better known as the Facebook rapist for using the social networking site to lure his victims, has been captured in Tanzania after an attempt to fake his own death to escape a South African prison. He was at large for a whole year before being caught with his girlfriend and a third suspect. Biestad would be extradited back to South Africa to face charges for rape and murder. His escape has sparked outrage in the country with one of the highest rates of sexual assault. Two teachers at Kanye West's Donda Academy are suing him, the school, and its directors for code violations and discriminatory practices. The women claimed that they were fired in retaliation for reporting unsafe practices by the school. These allegedly included lack of genitorial, medical, and disciplinary measures. The teachers claimed that the students were subject to bullying and that there were discriminatory practices against black female teachers. Kanye West is yet to comment, but I'm sure he will. That's all for today, guys. I hope you had a great Easter weekend and I hope you're ready for work tomorrow. Make sure you keep in touch with us and keep the conversation going on social media using the hashtag MBS News For You. From me, Tracy Ikopitz, signing out.